Hello, my name is Vadim Brashkin. I am a deputy director of the Institute for High Pressure Physics in Troitsk in Moscow. The scope of interests of our group primarily concerns the behavior of liquids and glasses under very high pressures. My colleagues and me have recently published a review in Physics Uspehe about the properties of liquid at pressures much higher than the pressure of the liquid gas critical point. It is generally agreed that the phase diagram of most substances includes solid, vapor, and liquid states, and that supercritical region of a liquid consists of one single state, so-called supercritical fluid. In our review, we show that liquids, even in this supercritical region, exist in two qualitatively different states, solid-like liquid, we call rigid liquid, and gas-like fluid, we call it non-rigid liquid. These states are divided from each other by the new dynamic line on the phase diagram. This line is universal. It separates two liquid states at arbitrary high pressure and temperature and exists in systems where a liquid gas transition and the critical point are absent altogether. Dynamical line, we call it friendly line, corresponds to the loss of shear stiffness of a liquid at all frequencies. We remind that the ability of liquid to flow is associated with zero shear rigidity that distinguishes liquids from solids. Liquids, however, have zero rigidity only at small frequency. However, if liquid cannot sustain rigidity at any frequency, it behaves like a gas. We analyze the new line theoretically, as well as in real and model fluids, and show that this line corresponds to the quality change of most of liquid properties. Here you can see the quality change of the temperature dependencies of sound velocity, viscosity, and thermal conductivity of liquid nitrogen at pressures by 10, 30, and 100 times higher than the critical one. The physical reason of the existence of solid-like and gas-like liquids is the quality difference between the particle movement in solid, liquid, and gas. The particle dynamics in solids is purely oscillatory. You can see the atomic vibrations in crystalline krypton near its melting temperature. Particle movement in gases is purely ballistic and collisional. You can see here the dense Leonard Jones gas. The dynamics of a liquid near melting curve, on the other hand, involve both oscillations and jumps to the nearest atomic cage. The relative contributions of the two types of particles motion in the liquid change depending on the temperature and pressure. If the oscillatory part in the liquid dynamics disappears, the system reaches the discovered dynamic line and it transforms to gas-like state. You can read about new line on the phase diagram and you can find details about supercritical fluid behavior in our recent review in Physics Uspehi.